hello everyone and welcome back to your own channel technical sahil in today's video we are going to see that how we can access the ftp user uh, of a specific website on dreamhost hosting let's say i have this hosting and i want to access uh, the ftp user of this fiverrsellertools.com so what we need to do is simply click on websites and click sftp users and files and also we need a software uh, which is uh, filezilla i will provide the uh, download link in the description below you can simply download this exe from here if your computer is 64 bit otherwise i will also provide the download link of that to it so you just need to download it from here after that you can install it uh, it is super easy to install you just need to pass some uh, yes yes uh, clicks on the wizard and it will install and show you an interface like this after that you need to select that uh, particular website currently this is the website which we want to access the ftp user so we need to click here in the three dots and allow insecure connections ftp confirm enabling ftp now this will take a minute of yours Please wait till then patiently. Once it's done, you simply need to click here, uh, login info. And here, that's the host name, which we can copy it from here and paste it here. And that's the username which we need to copy and provide it here. Now password, it's asking us for uh, changing the password. So let's click here and generate a strong password and copy the same password and click reset password. Now this will also take a minute. So please wait uh, till that. In the meantime, I will paste the password also from uh, to here. Now in the port, we need 21 because we have enabled it for the FTP. Now, once it's done, we can simply log into our FTP. Uh, let me show you in a minute. The password has been updated. Now we simply uh, need to click on quick connect. And you can see it's done. And now we can access the uh, website and other directories like mail directory logs simply we need to click this uh, double click this uh, fiber seller tools and it will show us the uh, website contents the website which is uh, currently we have installed a fresh wordpress on uh, this directory so it's showing us the same we can also uh, right click and download uh, refresh delete rename anything from here and this way we can access the website contents via FTP user. So that's all for this video and thank you so much for watching it till the end.